Hey guys and welcome back to Nifty Challenge. So, just a topic came through my mind, and the purpose is not just making a video. And uh, there are a lot of uh, friends of mine, students of mine, who keep asking me about some stocks whether we should buy. This looks like a one of them is Rohan. I hope you are listening to this video. He works in an insurance company. He told me, Captain, insurance sector looks very promising for the next ten years. And a lot more things you keep asking me today, Path. You also asked me about the stock of HDFC Life. Now, before I proceed, uh, let me show you some data and some things. Why and how do you need to catch a bigger picture in the market? You know, when you become an investor, when you start thinking about investing for long term. See, market doesn't move on data for uh, what you see presently. Market always moves two to three years in advance. Okay, a company stock which is moving is something which people have already seen its progress for the next two to three years. Now here are here I am discussing about a special sector that is insurance sector, and you might have seen a lot of videos on YouTube people recommending LIC share, Fatega, ye bo. Let me show you some magic that happens on YouTube, and now you have been fooled. I'm not saying these people are wrong. I may be wrong, but uh, see what uh, to say. I mean. that you should just use your mind sometime you know and see nivesh ka shandar mauka dekhiye aap stock mein nivesh kitna sahi what does i see i'm not uh, against any channel sorry if you are <laughs> seeing anything like that if anybody from the owner of this channel is seeing my video don't be offended please so let me just show you what recently happened on lic share So just now, LIC quarter result came. The profit has zoomed to fifteen thousand nine hundred and fifty-two crores. That is more than the profit of HDFC Bank. That is more than the profit of SBI. So whether you should, what do you think? You should invest in a share like this or not? Now I'll just talk with basis of my knowledge. I am very less knowledgeable compared to you all on these matters. So just sharing a thought of why I feel that. This is the sector I'm going to be big shot for the next two to three years, especially insurance sector. Fifteen thousand crore profits posted in the last quarter on LIC. HDFC Life net profit rises by nineteen percent year on year to three hundred twenty-six crores. ICICI September profit has risen from four hundred ten to six hundred and nine crores. So all the insurance companies are rising, 18.14 percent rise. So is it a good sign? What do you think? Now let me show you something more. Let me start with some messages that I keep getting. I'm sure you might be getting these messages as well. And I see agents, mutual fund agents. They keep sending you a lot of plans. So one of them. I'm sorry if you're watching my video, buddy. Let's see. New plan from L I C. Uh. Okay. Let's see what is the plan. So this is the plan. I am not interested in all this. I am not interested what they are giving. The only thing I am interested is, is 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 this. What is my yield? Five point one four percent with tax benefit. Eight point one one. percent all right let's come to another one without tax benefit 6.37% with tax benefit 6.81% they want me to block my money for a period of 20 fucking years man 20 damn years my goodness 6% returns 20 damn years let's go further what is the yield i am only interested in the yield nothing else sir i am only interested in the yield maybe they don't even tell you this some smart people don't even tell you that okay they don't mention it so in general any insurance any particular life insurance general insurance 
टर्म प्लान पॉलिसी प्लान दे डोंट गिव यू रिटर्न मोर देन सिक्स टू सेवन परसेंट कमिंग बैक आई होप यू आर गेटिंग टू मी वॉट आई एम ट्राइंग टू टेल यू वॉट इज इन्फ्लेशन इन इंडिया राइट नाउ सेवन पॉइंट फोर वन परसेंट इन सेप्टेम्बर टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू सो एवरी ईयर थिंग्स आर गेटिंग एक्सपेंसिव बाई सेवन परसेंट एवरी ईयर थिंग्स आर गेटिंग एक्सपेंसिव बाई सेवन परसेंट इट वेंट अप टू टेन परसेंट डब्ल्यू पी आई इन्फ्लेशन टूडे द डेटा के मेरे एट पॉइंट थ्री नाइन परसेंट नाउ डू यू थिंक इट इज एडवाइजेबल फॉर मी टू इन्वेस्ट इन ट्वेंटी ईयर लॉक इन पीरियड पुटिंग माई मनी टू गेट पुटिंग माई मनी टू गेट अ रिटर्न ऑफ सिक्स पॉइंट फोर सिक्स पॉइंट थ्री सिक्स पॉइंट फाइव परसेंट वाइल सेवन पॉइंट फोर परसेंट इज द इन्फ्लेशन आई होप यू गेटिंग द आंसर आई होप यू आर गेटिंग माई आंसर वाई आई एम नॉट गोइंग टू बाय एनी शेयर ऑफ द इंश्योरेंस सेक्टर फॉर द नेक्स्ट टू टू थ्री ईयर्स ना वाई टू टू थ्री ईयर्स This is based on a different study. This is based on a study of deflationary burst. Now, this is something that will be coming in future. I'm not making a video for deflationary burst right now, but with a period of inflation, when there is rising rising inflation in the country, after two to three years, a time comes of deflation. Now, we will discuss that when the time is right. but as of now with the rising inflationary pressure i don't find it right to invest in any insurance sector now do you think i'm the only one who has this knowledge believe me people know these things in advance so these high figures of profits that you are seeing is nothing but a trap is nothing but a trap because believe me the country is getting smarter people are getting smarter right now only 5% of people invest in india this is going to grow higher do one more thing do a research and search in how many countries in europe in france in spain in us in argentina in south america in asian countries how many people actually buy these term plans for their kids and all these things and why they don't do it and you will see this is only a big business of india okay now i am not against anything neither anybody has paid me to make this video i'm just giving you a rough idea of knowledge why i am not interested in this 6 7% annual yield rather i would invest in equities and stock markets and that is what people big guns they already know and these rises in these shares and this sector is not at all promising for me for the next 2 to 3 years now definitely i may be wrong why because only 5% of people in india invest still 1995% don't invest and they see these as safe returns but in reality if you have understood my data they are losing 1 to 2% per annum investing in these plans that's all my message i hope my message is very clear to you nothing much in the video just a very short one and hopefully you did enjoy it thank you so much and all the best